Hey, what's up, guys? Dave with Build Alpha. A uh, bunch of new updates to the software. Going to go over a handful of them in this video. First thing I did was add this quick chart. Uh, so basically what it does is it is a visual pop-up that allows you to use the keypad to scroll through all the strategies that Build Alpha created. Uh, that should hopefully increase your workflow. Second thing I did was add a little bit to the metrics button. Now again, you've seen this before, but this inverse out of sample. Basically, the idea behind this is you want to see your in sample is comparable to your out of sample. So you can see here a 2.0 profit factor correlates with a 2.0 profit factor um, in both the in and out of sample. This is just a shout out to the user that gave this idea. Um, this is really the groundwork. Going to build on this uh, in and out of sample comparison and a bunch of new features coming this year. Um, just wanted to show that. Another quick thing did was you can view all of the performance metrics throughout the history of the back test. Again, you probably don't want to be making decisions off of performance metrics that look like an EKG machine uh, reading. Monte Carlo equity bands again. This just shows you where you can expect to be with 95% confidence uh, after X trades into the future. But at the bottom, out of these stats, you can quickly see uh, after 20, 50, and 100 trades. Shout out to the Build Alpha user for that idea. And then some other quick things. Uh, created a Python script that you can run in Build Alpha that will allow you to import trade, tra trade station strategies from the performance report. Um, so that allows you to do a little further analysis and, of course, combine your trade station strategies with um, build alpha strategies and other non-build alpha or non-trade station strategies in build alpha's portfolio mode. Um, added a bunch of new indicators, but I'm not going to get into those because I got a series of blog posts ready to go for those. Um, and for you intraday guys, build alpha now accepts time format and hour, hour, minute, minute, and also hour, hour, minute, minute, second, second, so you can really dig down. Um, and other than that, just did some back end stuff to make the processing time a bit faster and to get ready for what's going to be a big, big 2018. As always, thank you for the support and for checking out this video. Take care.